It is another stressful day for James Akutu and his younger brothers. They live at Kuala Kuyum, a village in the Adan district of the Greater Accra region. They have to walk several kilometers to get access to water. The water is unsafe for human consumption. But they are left with no option because that is their only source of water. Their mother, Comfort Sapo, uses the water to wash and cook. They also use the water for bathing. His mother has just finished preparing his breakfast as he gets ready to go to school. Oh, thank you, mommy. This is certainly not a pleasant experience. The water used to prepare this Tom Brown leaves might to be desired. At least, it was on fire for some time, so we are assured all the gems are dead. But this is the kind of situation in which the people find themselves, and they are in dire need of help. The situation at Kuala Kuyum is more pronounced in the dry season. Just like James, there are many children in Ghana who do not have access to safe drinking water. They faced a daily struggle to access enough good quality water for drinking, cooking and washing. The water we are using is not good. We need help from the, the government. When we drink it, we have Ebola. In most cases, majority of the people living in rural areas depend on water sources which are contaminated and prone to waterborne diseases. Rural Water Aid International has been helping to provide portable water to communities without access to safe drinking water. Today, their destination is Kuala Kuyum. The organization uses a water purification system to provide portable water. Residents of the village, both old and young, have come to fetch some of the treated water. <laughs> 